We kissed and we held hands all the way to the store, but we didn't say a word. is really warm just like Nana's I never want to let go of this hand ever how can I make him understand the way I feel I didn't turn away Takumi even though I was hanging out with Nobu now no matter what I say how can he trust me The truth is, I've been holding back the whole time. I wanted to be Nobu's girlfriend. I wanted to be close to him. I was secretly hoping for the day he'd hold me. Every time we walked along this path by the river. So what does this all mean? What are you thinking? I'm too afraid to ask. You can take me away right now if you want to. But what do I do if he thinks I'm just some stupid girl who falls for guys even though she has a boyfriend? He'll end up seriously hating me. <sighs> What's with all this pointless talk, Baldy? <laughs> We just have to sell records, right? How hard can that be? Just tell Kawano to hurry up and work out our contract. It's pretty straightforward. Okay? You got that? Okay. God, I'm so tired of this. My hair is gonna fall out. I'm gonna take a bath and go to bed. Huh? Aren't you gonna stay up till Hachiko gets back? She's not coming back, which means I lose the bet. Huh? I'd bet a hundred he's done before he starts. But doesn't she have a boyfriend? Well, if I can't crash at Nobu's, then I guess I'll be a good boy and go to my parents tonight. Your parents? Oh, hello, Ryoko. I bet you had a long day today. Sorry I'm calling so late. Mm-hmm. I'm fine. I'm coming over right now. See you later, Misato. Take care. What? You're leaving? Seriously? Sheen, wait. Huh? Tell me something. Who's Ryoko? She's the woman who raised me. Don't lie. I know that you weren't raised by a woman. Huh? How do you know that? If you don't want people finding out who you are, you should at least be smart enough to use an alias. <sighs> Fine. I'm not gonna give anyone my full name ever again. 
Not that I care if they find anything out. It's just that I don't like people snooping around in my personal life. Then maybe you should stop doing stupid things that freak everyone out. You can put up a front all you want, but you're still a kid. We need to get your legal guardian signature on the record contract. Oh. So if you don't want to see him, I can get his signature. Hmm. Do what you have to do, Yasu. Hey, Misato. I'm gonna go home, too. Huh? Sorry, but I've got a lot of work to do. Oh, that's fine. I really don't mind. But does that mean you're admitting you lost the bet? Miss Hachiko already has a boyfriend, so are you all right with that? I mean, is Nobu all right with that? Uh, well, guys can become pushovers around the girls they love. And I don't even pretend to understand the complexities of the female species. I get it. It's sort of a complicated situation. I'm sorry. I really should just stay out of it. <laughs> so, you're gonna be staying here the whole summer? Your parents don't mind that you're away? No, no, you don't need to worry about me. Do you mind if I ask you a question? Um, okay. Misato Uehara, what is your real name? <gasps> it's top secret. So she really does use a fake name. And she seems like such a good girl. I'll never understand women. Man, oh man. Hmm. Hachi? Oh, here she is. There's gonna be fireworks, and it's nearby. Huh. Wanna go together? I'll carry one. It's cool. Oh. Actually, you can. I didn't really know. We must be in sync with each other. Do you really think so? Because I have to admit I'm a bit lost here. So maybe you could tell me what's going on. Is it telepathy? Listen to what I'm saying. I'm sorry. I have a tendency to get carried away. Oh, no. To tell you the truth, I really like how you sometimes have this wild imagination. You're disappointed. It's my fault. Wait a minute. Is this push-pull game of yours some sort of method to make guys fall for you? You're such a natural, and it works so well. I'm not! What a terrible woman! You're an agent of the Demon Lord, that's why you always talk I'm about not. him! But you're the one who said you were a horrible girl. <gasps> I was joking! I'm sorry. I promise I'll break it off with Takumi. <sighs> it's just that... I... I really didn't want anyone to know about me and Takumi. I was pretending that it didn't really happen. And then, I could be your girlfriend. I guess in the end, I just screwed up everything. <laughs> Do you hate me now? Huh? <laughs> no, I never could. <laughs> Stop staring at me with those big teary eyes. I can't help but say whatever you want. The thing is, I can't take you away from him. And I don't own you. And I don't want to make you sneak around, either. If we let things get out of control now, you're just gonna end up feeling trapped between me and Takumi. And you'll tear yourself apart, because you care about people. But I don't think you screwed things up. You really shouldn't be so hard on yourself. I'm sure you can't help it that you're attracted to Takumi. And no matter how hard I try, I just can't compete with him. That's not true, really, I... But even so, if you tell me that you'll break up with him and go out with me, I'll do whatever it takes to make you happy. <gasps> For 
the sake of your happiness, I will do everything within my power. I promise. Am I dreaming? I mean, I feel like I can do anything with you by my side. But in this dream, I don't have to wake up. So once you've broken up with Takumi and sorted out your feelings, then come to me. I'll be waiting for you. Hinana, I've fallen in love so many times. But until that day, I didn't think a guy existed in real life who would seriously talk to me like that. Is this the way Ren talks to you, Nana? I really want to talk to you. Huh? Welcome back, Miss Hachiko. Sorry for getting back so late. It's okay. That didn't take long. So, you're alone? Hey, where are Sheen and Yasu? Oh, they already took off. Huh? But I went to the store to buy them all this stuff. Oh, sorry. Anyway, we can just use it for another party. What happened to Nobu? Uh, he walked me here, but he said he has to work in the morning, so we went to his place. Oh, really? So something did happen. Well, I guess we can call it a night. I've got to work in the morning, too, so mind if I jump in the tub first? Oh, wait! Nana's in there! <gasps> I knew you'd just barge in here. Some people would think you're a real perv. Nana. You can't just jump in here. What the hell are you thinking anyway? But it's cool because we're both girls. Look, I don't take baths with other chicks. So you take baths with guys? Yeah, why not? That's just weird. Not as weird as taking a bath with a female dog that just returned home from a walk. Wait, Nana! I have to tell you about me and Nobu. Mm -hmm. So what's up with Nobu? -o? me to go see the fireworks with him. Huh. Then go. Does that schoolboy even have a He's useless! So Yasu won the bet. No wonder he's in charge. It's like he knows everything about everyone in the band. I'll have a real talk with Nana after I end things with Takumi. I owe it to her. She's the one who helped me meet him, and she supported me after we got together. I'm sure she'll be like, what the hell? If I were in Nana's shoes, that's what I would be thinking. I mean, really, who wouldn't think that way? I'll say goodbye to him over the phone. I don't want to see his face when he gets hurt. He's so full of pride. Lately, there's been some mosquitoes buzzing around outside my apartment. It's so annoying. Huh? Your place too? Oh man, I thought it was just me. For once, I felt like the star of the it's band. It's not a good thing. Mosquitoes? Well, it is summer. Rayra, please tell me you're kidding. The paparazzi have been coming by my place, too. I wonder whose blood they really want to suck. They must be around my place, too. This is bad. It's your blood they want. Oh, yeah. You've got a girlfriend staying at your place, don't you? Send her home before any of them find out. We can't afford any scandals with you in oh, it. Oh, it isn't that bad. Ren Honjo madly in love. That's not disgraceful. In fact, I think it's adorable. I'll tell her she has to dress hot whenever she goes out from now on. When will we be done here? I want to return home to my annoying mosquitoes. Then just leave. I've already told you that the band does just fine with or without you, dude. Ah! Huh? Hmm. Didn't have to get back to me that fast. Hello? 
did you want to talk to me about? Come on, what's the matter? I can't do it like this. Breaking up with someone over the phone? That's pretty cold. Um, can we get together to talk? Uh, sorry, we're doing a TV show right now. Oh, sorry to bug you like this. That's okay, we spend more time sitting around than we do shooting. That's such a drag. You hardly ever go on TV. That'll be on satellite. They're doing a special on us. Oh, that's too bad, because we don't have satellite TV. Well, if you're a fan, you should get it. Oh, this is no good. Don't get sucked back in. What's wrong? You don't want to talk about it on the phone? Unfortunately, my schedule is going to be crazy busy for a while. Oh, right, of course. What is it? Don't tell me you're pregnant. Huh? No, that's not it! <sighs> so it's something else. Thank God. You scared me there. I may not look it, but I'm actually one of those sensitive artist types. I don't deal well with inconveniences like that. I'm sorry. Inconvenience? Getting a girl pregnant is just some inconvenience for him? What's wrong with him? Is he even human? And why do I keep apologizing? Time to go, dude. Yeah. Sorry, I gotta go right now, but I'll call you back when I have more time to talk. Why bother? In fact, don't ever call me again! Uh... So goodbye! Mm. I did it. I told him off. So that's it. I think Nana's pissed off at me. Nana? Oh, even Hachiko. Well, I'd be mad at you too. Don't tell me you're pregnant. <laughs> you scared me. And you say you're sensitive? You don't have an ounce of sensitivity. But it really would suck. I was just trying to be honest. It actually probably sucked the most for her. Well, if that's how you feel, you really ought to start wearing condoms. Yeah, right. Like, you should talk. But I'm cool with it. In fact, I could go for the family life. But she's back on the pill again. That feminist. And it's all about what you want? He's not even calling me back. How come? I guess that was easy. Why was I with someone who didn't really care about me? It's a harsh awakening from my wildest dreams. But really, I knew from the start that Takumi didn't love me. There's no way that I could hurt his feelings. I just finally woke up from a nightmare. Every time we got together, we'd go to bed and he'd say things I wanted to hear. And it felt really good to touch someone. I guess I was hoping it would turn into real love. But that was nothing but an illusion. Finally, I've woken up to the truth. I'll be waiting for you. I'm awake now. Because my real prince kissed me. Well, he doesn't look like a typical prince, but I guess that's okay. Ah! You scared me! Sorry if it seems like I'm stalking you. It's just that Nana told me where you work. I didn't know that you worked in a cool record store. Wow, no wonder you have so many records in your room. Uh, well, I only work here twice a week. I also do some odd jobs here and there. Oh, I see. By the way, what time do you get off today? At nine. Cool, then I'll just wait for you at the cafe next door. Huh? Come to think of it, there are a lot of things I don't know about Nobu yet. I want to learn everything about him. I think his blood type is A. Which means he's serious. Damn! I can't sit still! How was work today? Ah! Don't sneak up on me like that! Hey, Nobu, are you hungry? I came straight from work, so I haven't eaten anything yet. Oh. Then let's go get a bite to eat. It'd be cheaper if I made you something at your place. Huh? My place? No way! Why not? I told you to come to me after you'd work things out with Takumi. But I did. That's why I came. It's too fast! I, I'm 
I'm sorry. So much stuff has happened between now and then. It feels more like a year has passed than a day. Yeah, but it doesn't really matter what it felt like. One day is still one day. Okay, then. I'll try to wait one more day. Huh? Can you make stew with beef and potatoes? It's my specialty! She's so cute! Oh, let's just pretend that a year has passed. Where's Hotchko? Oh, she text messaged me saying she might not come home tonight. Maybe she's at her boyfriend's again? What? But I thought they were gonna be filming until midnight. <sighs> hey, Nana. What does Ren say to you when you're making love? I should have asked you then. I should have found out. That old clawfoot bathtub isn't around anymore. 